Hello, greetings, and welcome. I am Jeff the Christian Gamer, and we are going to take our first look at Pokemon Quest. Depending on how, um, yeah, there we go. Depending on how in depth this game is, or how interesting it is, and how linear, etc., it is, I may consider doing more with the game than just a uh, simple uh, look into the game itself. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and check this thing out and see what we got here. Choose my language. Um, oh, actually. There we go. Just realized I, uh, I hadn't. Oh, interesting. Won't be able to change the language you choose. You won't be able to change the language you choose later. Would you like to play in English? Yes, I would like to play in English. Huh. And there could be a lot of precious loot to be discovered. Okay. Cool. Uncover its awesome loot. <laughs> I wonder when loot became the common vernacular for uh, video game uh, items obtained through questing, etc. Like, was it always called loot? I know a lot of games that uh, didn't necessarily call it loot, uh, like treasure and um, your haul. I remember H-A-U-L uh, being used in a couple. <clears throat> Alright, well. Oh, it's a polka drone. Alright, cool. This game already has a lot of potential based on the art style. It's a very clean game. Huh. The owner's name. Let's see. Go ahead and go with my normal. Uh, yeah, lock it. Then T C G. All right, sweet. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> Huh. Huh. Got the Pokemon I want to befriend. Um. Wow, what a tough random choice to have to make right away. Uh. Me personally, I've never started with uh, Squirtle, so I'll go that route this time. Uh, 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 there you go. Oh, jeez. Come here. Uh, I can't. I can't. I can't select you. Oh, uh, there we go. Will you choose Squirtle? Yeah, I'm noticing the controls are a little wonky. Um, it's like a set amount of space that you can go, no matter how quickly you move the control stick. That is troublesome. All right. Anyway. Guide me, Squirtle. Pokemon move forward uh, toward enemies on their own and attack them. Okay. 
wild Pokemon. That is a uh, Rattata. What do I do? What do I do? Help. Help. What do I do? Wave cleared. Okay. That's cool. Wild well, Pokemon. Pokemon no moves. By tapping the icon for one of your Pokemon moves, you can give the order to use that move. Okay. Too easy. So, uh, I'm gonna go for Whirlpool. Oh. Gotta say, that's fun. Oh, I can knock over boulders and stuff. Pretty legit. Okay, this is already addictive. I think I've made a mistake. And by mistake, I mean most awesome choice ever. Tackle. That'll do some serious damage. Uh, my other issue with this game so far is I cannot rotate the camera. At least not that I know of at the moment. Power stones are important items that you can give your Pokemon to make them stronger. Okay. As you progress through stages, you'll be able to get strong power stones. Cool. Hmm, I think we can end our expedition for now. I need to find a place where I can set up a base camp. What do you know? A perfect place that has a pot already. Alright, what about a bizarre, uh, that bizarre stone I found earlier? Is there some way I could use it? You probably gotta cook it, dude. When the... Oh, Pokemon body starts to glow. My Pokemon's body starts to glow. Uh, it's too okay. Put it on a squirrel. Come on, buddy. Alright. Um... Okay. Start to put a power stone. Okay, you can raise your po Huh. Cool. So what is this raise? Mighty Stone, attack plus 50. Nice. Put whatever stone that will stop it from you. Uh, where is this Everstone? I want to make sure my Squirtle gets to, like, max level before I tell him to evolve. Alright. Let's do some expeditions. Start the island expedition from Dungeon Icon. This is fascinating already. Oh, the game is to find. Okay. Cool. to go to okay cool no problem oh he's so buff now Good job, Squirtle. Oh, I missed. That was a fail. Indeed, I am definitely liking this game. Animations are crisp, the battle system is easy and intuitive. Um, only thing that I say that I'm not too terribly a fan of is the uh, is the control for the uh, finger 
icon thing. Uh, I think that has a lot to do with the fact that, uh, nice. It has a lot to do with the fact that, um, this was made as a touchscreen game, and I'm okay with that. Related slot, maybe? And I got a mighty stone. Attack plus 57 instead of just 50. Found some ingredients it looks like we could cook with. Okay, if you cook something, it could uh, should attract some Pokemon. Alright, well, let's uh, go to the base camp. Food, Pokemon, I like the kind of food will come visit your base camp. Okay. Tap an ingredient icon, put that ingredient in your cooking pot. Once you fill the pot, you're ready to cook. Okay. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay. There we go. Put you in there. Put you in there. Put you in there. Oh, they're teaching me a recipe already. Yes. So. Bluck berries. What is this called? The tiny mushroom and an apricorn. Okay, let's roast up some stuff. When your dish is finished, it will depend on how. Okay. Okay. You finish cooking your dish right away. Okay. Time. There are some. Okay. Uh. Huh. Stew a la cube. Nice. Okay. So we have a Pidgey and a Rattata. Added to Pokedex. Okay. Got a new buddy. Cool. Congratulations, you befriend a new Pokemon. Now keep on befriending Pokemon. Cool. Okay. As Pokemon, you befriend to your expedition team. So I need to edit my team. Looks like I can only have three Pokemon at a time. Which is perfect, because now I happen to have three Pokemon. Put you in there. Put you over there. Alright. Looking nice. Okay. So I guess this is the scope of the game, eh? Set. When you press auto set button, your ingredients will be set randomly. I see. Even though that's the exact recipe I just learned. Your ingredients will be used up when you cook. Yes, I would like to use those ingredients. It should be finished cooking after you've gone on a few expeditions. Don't forget to start making a new dish before you head on to the next expedition. Okay, so I need to do two expeditions and then that'll be done. How convenient! Total of your team members HP and attack is your team strength. Okay. Okay, you have idea which team strength me. Okay. Uh, Pokemon at the same time as one time. Okay. Okay, cool. What is my current? Okay, I'm 660. That's good. It's out. Have a pretty good shot at beating this. 
expedition start. Positive, this game will be easier on the touchscreen, so I'll be playing it in handheld mode more than likely. That fact alone will probably make this not necessarily a game that I would prefer to uh, do a full clear or something like that with. Stone HP plus 67. Okay. Okay, Marte. I think that will help find expeditions on Tokyo Island from the Pokemart. Okay. So, what is the form of currency? Special items called PM tickets to buy things from the Pokemon. Okay. As a service for members, you can receive PM tickets on a regular basis. Okay. Receive PM tickets. No clothes. Don't forget to pick them up and play the game. No problem, man. 21 hours and I'll be able to get more uh, PM tickets. I'm assuming PM stands for like Pokemon Master or something like that. Cool. Well, um, let's check out these quests because I saw an exclamation point. You receive okay. Sometimes you can even, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Uh -huh. Basics of strength. Pokemon. Uh, close range. Go on expeditions with only close range Pokemon. I got 15 fossils now. Yay! Okay, you get stuff during the session. That's a good idea to try to. Okay. Cool. Make 10 normal buddies. Okay. I had to be very quick with my motions. I, I see that what I'm doing wrong now. Okay, so what I'm gonna do... Actually... Okay, so what I'm gonna do is put you in there you there and since I am loving Pidgey's moves I'm gonna go ahead and put you in there all right now I think we're properly powered up it's our total power is looking like 794 which is just right oh Finish another quest. And 5 p.m. tickets. Yay! Okay, we'll go ahead and check out the shop because they keep giving me these tokens and I'm kind of curious. Uh, well, tickets rather. Uh, 
additional content. Special paid additional content. Oh, paid additional special set of decorations. Um, effective decorations. Decorations are handy items that will make your expeditions on the island more efficient. Okay. Decorations have special effects to activate. That activate automatically when you purchase them. You can also decorate your base camp with them by tapping the decorations button. Okay. These chars are torch due. Size of red and green. Okay. Um, size of blue ingredient drops by 1.5. Now I'm gonna see how much this is. I'm curious. And it expedition three pack bundle all in one bargain bundle. Wow. Um. Oh, and then you get all three of them together. Huh. Cool. Okay, um, actually, I'll check that out later because it seems like it's gonna be a sidebar that we don't need to take right at this second. So let's keep on moving. If you defeat large Pokemon that appear at the end of the expedition. Okay. Pidgeotto. got defeated. I see. And after a certain amount of time, he'll come back. Pretty cool. Sturdy stone. HP plus 71. Critical hit damage plus 6.5. Okay, yeah, this is a pretty, uh, everything seems to be going, okay, far as you go, strong power, okay, you should collect more power, so get Noted. So this quest, uh, start up an expedition, trainer, I will receive that. That. Okay, that'll be it. Alright, let's 
go to base camp and then we'll meet the Pokemon that we've attracted. Every 22 hours there's going to be a new Pokemon. Encounter rare Pokemon is division as a chance of making Okay, cool. A lot of mushrooms and a little red. Fire type Pokemon. Hot pot a la cute. Huh. I like it. Let's go growl it. Yeah, Growlithe is my boy. Pokemon Go, he was like the MVP. Okay, let's go ahead and edit my team. And swap out that uh, rat. Okay. Go back. And I'll see what I can do to enhance him. First off, put that on our main boy here, and then uh, go ahead and throw this guy on Growlithe, and yep, that'll be it. Did I do something wrong? Let me go ahead back to my base camp. Yeah, I didn't put anything in my pot. He just told me about this. <coughs> Boy. Let's try you out as an ingredient. Get me a, potentially a fossil type Pokemon. Actually, I have no idea how many I need, so I'm just going to throw, throw these back in the main queue here, and then... Yeah, we'll try that out. Okay, so that's another two expeditions. I'll go ahead and go and do a couple more. Looks like we have a boss. All for hell, come on, dude.
Growlithe is extremely, uh, extremely nimble. Oh, Eradicate. Side to the wonkiness of the control stick is these buttons are pretty forgive uh, the uh the sensor ranges for the buttons are pretty forgiving. Statue. Now your Pokemon up to level five can get EXP. Defeated a statue. Okay. Huh. first. I already see Pidgey's gonna be like my last, last in line for skills. Wait time percentage increased by five, uh, decreased by five. Useful for me. Uh, I think that will probably be more useful to growl in because he is a monster. Cycle is going to come in handy soon. Uh, it looks like this is going to be a 
kind of difficult. But I think our Poke friends can handle it. I can see how that can get him overwhelmed. So I have to be a little more careful with it. They are strong against water, but not against fire. Oh yeah, they kill the crap out of Squirtle. Uh, pretty beastie. Okay, so we'll go ahead and finish the quest here. Cool. I'm glad these uh, quests are simple. See what I attracted with that strange thing. Mulligan stew a la cube. Okay. Vulpix. Nice. like a tanky type. I think I'll put him in place of Pidgey. Well, him or her, I can't. I mean, there's no genders on Pokemon. At least not on these particular Pokemon. Um, in t -way. Not going too deep into that rabbit hole right now. Okay. And then we will go back. Then we will go ahead and pick up the quest for a rookie chef. And we'll do a challenge. A shiny Pokemon, your buddy. I guess Vulpix counts as a shiny Pokemon. Okay. Properly equip Vulpix. Looks like she can only be equipped with. Oh, good. That means I don't have to. Ooh. Put this 78 on uh, my Squirtle here. We'll uh, put the 57 on. Oh no, we can't put the 57 on Vulpix. It's like a. Vulpix is basically a specialty. Specialty um, unit.
Okay. Now we need to set stuff in the pot again. Pot stuffs. <laughs> I want some pot stuff. I apologize. Various dishes you can cook depending on how you combine your ingredients. Both Pokemon and the combination ingredients from the recipe menu. Okay. There are some hidden recipes that are especially appealing to certain Pokemon. Okay. So. Favorite food of some Pokemon? Okay. Whatever ingredients, whatever you eat, you like. Huh. What was the one that I put in before? Hot Pot a la Cube. Favorite of Fire type Pokemon? That looks. Uh, I think I will put those back. I'll try the fossil things here. Since they're the same color. Oh. See what we get when we start cooking this. I need two again. Let's go to expeditions and uh, we'll complete, probably we'll end up completing about two more before calling it an episode here because we're knocking on that hour mark. But yeah, this is a fascinating game. You can tell it's very deep and it's actually very fun so far. Oh, she has a cute little roar. Yes, I am randomly assigning my Pokemon different genders. And no, I do not know what they actually are. I apologize for anybody that may offend. Even though Vulpix feels like a tank, she is definitely uh, doing a pretty good job as a distractor. Spam that move. Pretty close. 
close. This is gonna end up being my tank. Sturdy stone, mighty stone. Okay. Considering the fact that, uh, okay, yeah, I'll talk about that in a minute. But I was gonna say, based on how the uh, how the Pokemon are faring in battle, I may want to. Uh, consider a different way of gearing them up, but I'll do that after this fight.
gray porridge a la cube. Okay, a whole lot of gray. Favorite food and crayfish Pokemon. And I'm going to refill our container. Let's try nothing but apricorns. Alright, start cooking. sort of my thing. I like strategy games. I also like RPGs. Okay. Let's see what we got here.
outstanding job in battle. Um, I will be the strongest attack stuff that I have for him. Okay, Ryanhorn is not striking me as the smartest right now. Now we can increase your health. Okay, well, that was fun. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed this game, and its uh, aesthetic is very pleasing. Block and Cube thing has been working well for a lot of different companies out there, and I'm glad that the uh, Pokemon Company has made it their thing to create a game like this. It's very uh, fun to uh, play in this sort of style of game. Especially when the graphics are just crisp. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Jeff the Christian Gamer. If you'd like to like and or subscribe, you may do that by clicking on the links provided. Also, if you'd like to check out other videos I've made, you may do that by clicking on the links in this video. I do have a Facebook and a Twitter, both geared towards making sure you guys know when I'm releasing my next videos. So, uh, yeah, go ahead and check that out, and I'll catch you guys next time.